and he was already playing piano at the tender age of three. Some years later, the year was 1981 to be exact, Luther delivered his debut solo LP, Never Too Much, long to be remembered as a double platinum masterpiece, and a new era of excellence in soul and popular music began. 40 million albums later, Luther Vandross has become universally recognized as one of soul and popular music's greatest masters. Yes. And now, in a musical tribute, in honor of my brother, the great Luther Vandross, please welcome Mr. Elder Bars, Mr. Johnny Gill, and Mr. Kenny Lattimore. Mr. Luther Vandross. say they blew my mind. Kenny, L, Johnny, Whitney, I mean, listen, that stuff sounds, and you all are so bad. Now, I want to thank a whole lot of people. I want to take out a minute and, uh, and thank Soul Train and Don Cornelius for this incredible acknowledgement. I love you back. I want to, uh, I want to thank my producers and, and co-writers and co-producers Marcus Millis and Marcus Miller and Nat Adley Jr. and Skip Anderson. And uh, I want to thank Epic Records for 18 wonderful years that brought me to this point. I want to thank uh, Virgin Records. And uh, I want to thank uh, Carmen Romano, my business manager, and, and all of my friends and the fans. You all have kept me here. And, and I'll tell you this, I'll tell you this. You see, I never drank and I never did drugs and I never smoked and I'm here to tell the story. They always ask me what to tell young people if, about their careers. Do it right, do it straight and do it because you love it. I love you, good night, thank you.